Hi, everybody. Hey, what's up? You found us in the pool, guys. Oh, wow. Okay, okay, so this is, we're outside in our backyard. It's like April our, something. In our above ground pool. Mm -hmm. And it's April the 20th. Oh, right? yeah, for all you stoners 420. out there. 420. Yeah. Hi, happy high. Uh, happy high day. <laughs> so, happy ho, hi, ho, hi, ho day. <laughs> but we're, we're out here, and actually, yeah. the thing is, I have a, a thermal cover that covers the pool, mm -hmm. so it's actually... Uh, 80, it's 83 right now. I just checked it. It's 83. Yeah. yeah. So here's, here's nice. yeah, that's cool. Beautiful. And, and and the outside temperature I think is about like uh, 92. 90, yeah. So it's a nice day out it's here. It's an epic day in the Valley of the yes, Sun. Yes, it and is. You found Mark and Rachel, and we're gonna do you a did. beer perspectives for you. We're doing pool. a beer perspective, and we're going to have what do we call it? Uh, the appraisal at the end of it. Yes. So the appraisal. We're but this is our perspective, the right? But the perspective okay. of, of what we're drinking. Let's start with this one. It's a big one. Um, this one is called uh, Fall of Troy. Oh, it's yeah. an Imperial India India Imperial Pale Ale. In, Imperial yeah. India Pale Ale. Orange vanilla I see on the top. The orange vanilla yes. Imperial IPA. Two so, of my favorites. It, oh, it's made by Belching Beaver. So that is. I, I love beavers and what belching. Is it? <laughs> uh, uh, where was it from? Uh, Oceanside, California. Oh, right. we love Oceanside, California. We haven't been there in years. Yeah, and and we've had we've had Belching Beaver before. Not um, a fan of beers. California in general, but I love Oceanside. But, yes, we've had that. So okay. this uh, is an IPA. So I don't know. Okay. Okay, it, like I said, orange vanilla IPA. That's gonna be interesting. Mm. That's an IPA. Last right? time we did a perspective, we had a orange Julius. Um, from our friend, oh, uh, wow. Malted uh, Gentleman. Yeah. Was it Malted Gentleman? Who said yeah, the Malted that? Gentleman, yeah. He um, talked about the neo neonic Orange Julius. Okay. Yeah. And that this was happens from... to be another orange one. We're going to compare and, notes here. And, and that, well, this is different. This is an IPA. Mm -hmm. so, How different um, would this be? Oh, it's going to be way different. I can already smell it. So here, here's here's what's going to be really cool, though, on this. I have cool hair. Uh, <laughs> I had to go and fix my hair because I, well, I have your hair looks the same. Come around though, like butter, no, right? It looks like different. butter. So let's see. Uh, okay. What's the what's the uh, alcohol content? Oh, it's eight point five. Ooh, it's a Ooh. big in. And this, so Pete. this was a one point uh, one pint can though. That's a big okay? one. Yeah. Compared to the other one, we're gonna so, do. What I'm saying is though, are you gonna get what I'm what I'm saying is that are you gonna get the orange vanilla flavor on an IPA out of this? I don't it's know. very curious because the hops might balance it out or count, can't it. cancel it. Smell out. it. You're gonna you're gonna say something to me. Ooh. <laughs> and what's I gonna say? You? You're, you well. You're go, yeah. You, ooh, you'll say, ooh, but then I get notes of vanilla. <laughs> ooh, I do vanilla. Kind of, I do through there, don't you? I do. Um, it's, okay, so it's a, it's kind of a cloudy beard. A okay. Bit. Don't and mind it's pretty, that. Yeah. And it's orangey and light. And yeah. it actually doesn't have a whole lot of floaty. Let's try this dish. Mm. Ooh, it's definitely hoppy. Oh, wow. Ooh, that's very that's hoppy. Good. But I get the vanilla note, so thank you. Wow, that's amazing. Hoppy okay. God. Thank what, you. What's really amazing is what they did here is what I taste. And, and I don't know if you do. Oh, but I do. They, they took it and, mm. and they actually added a, a, a sweet element to it, like the orange and vanilla. Yeah. I mean, after they, I don't know. Fall of Troy. Um, hmm. That's real good. This is what the Fall of Troy tastes like. Orange it, and vanilla. It has the real strong hoppy bitterness at the end. And you can smell the kind of the See, for me, I get it A little bit first. of the piney, the piney notes there. And I get the hoppy stuff first, and then it finishes with the sweet. I get the vanilla and the, the Well, no, orange. but at the very end, I can still taste it on my tongue. And I only took one, one drink. It was, was the, kind of the bitter note there. I, yeah, um, I get it too, but it's not overpowering. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. For an IPA, no. this is not bad. No, it's a it's a it's a good IPA. Yeah, it's really good. Thankfully, it has orange and vanilla in it. I said belching beaver. Yeah, fall of Troy. Eight point five. Eight point five percent. So this yeah. will get you warm and fuzzy, guys. Sure will. Oh, bring yeah. it up again. We'll vote oh, right. on that, I know. babe. And I'll That's actually I say, uh, it, it's like I said, it's a little cloudy. A little bit. That's a hazy. Yes, the, is it? Is that a hazy IPA? Did it say hazy? I don't yep. think it said hazy, did it? Well, isn't it in general an IPA is no. kind of hazy? Oh no. Oh. Okay. So, so the thing about IPAs is this: oh. if, if you don't realize, uh, from 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 California, uh, the the, the West Coast IPAs are usually well. I mean, I, they can be. Can you read but, this? But hazy IPAs come from yeah. Can we? 
Hazy IPAs uh, come from usually east, the east, east coast. coast. Yeah. East coast. So fall of Troy, or, yeah. but then again on the okay, this is confusing because uh, then again on the on the on the mm -hmm. west coast they're doing hazy IPAs now, but it Maybe started yeah. on the west, east coast. Yeah. Okay. So fall of Troy, say? orange vanilla imperial IPA. We're bringing back a fan favorite with dubious beginnings. Dubious. Let's just say it was a mistake, Ooh. Troy's mistake. Which proved to be ha a happy accident. This, this. Oh, Bob Ross, I love happy accidents. Yeah. There you go. This mosaic hop laden with Imperial IPA is smooth and juicy mm -hmm. with notes of orange and vanilla. It does have those notes. Troy is herby and inducted into our Brewers Hall of Shame. Herby. Alongside or herby. Herby. Oh. Herby. Like herby. herby. I said herby. Uh, herby. Yeah, sorry. Herby. herby. It's Troy and herb. Yeah. Mm. And inducted into our Brewers Hall of Shame alongside other legendary brews like Ivan the Terrible and Josh oh. Dammit. Josh Dammit. <laughs> I, like I want to be friends with Josh Dammit, well, I said. Th well, then they, they, they make those. So we should try that. We should try the Ivan the Terrible and Josh Dammit. That's Josh funny. Dammit. Okay, I want that. <laughs> I know it's Okay, good. so it's for good. all y'all looking at this, there's a beaver. He's orange. He's got a little hat on, mm -hmm. and he's going to come get you. There's, the, yep. there's what it looks like. You well, you're, Maybe you'll show a picture later. You're going to see a picture already, so it, it'll be there. Right, the okay, that's Troy. good. I like it. Uh, what's your appraisal that's on good. this, on our 1 to 10? Well, you want to appraise after we're done? Just, or you do it while now? we're thinking about oh. it. What do you like? What, do I, what do I think? Because uh, you know me and IPAs, right? Mm -hmm, you like it. I love IPAs. I like the I like the bitterness at the end. I, I love the that flavor. It never bothers me. For an IPA though. Oh. It's a really good one. It's it starts out I sweet, like ends a little bitter. But let me and try for to me it's time. opposite. I don't know how it's opposite. I get the hot fart, like whoo, and then it's like ah. Oh. For me, that's how it is. Oh, I see what you're saying. Wait. Mm -hmm. Okay, but. Okay, so but at the very end, if you if you don't drink another drink for about a minute, oh yeah, the sour comes back. The or the, 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 back. the the bitter note lingers on yeah. your tongue. At Which the end. is That's why what you saying. guys have to keep drinking. <laughs> yeah, right. That's why they invented yeah. that. Okay, here's <laughs> a, here's the next one we're doing. Okay, what are we doing? What'd you got? Uh, this is a. We learned how to say this, right? Go, goza. G O S. Goza. E goza. Go, goza. Goza. It's pronounced goza. like the lady's name, Rosa. 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 Do you say Rosa or Rosa? I don't know. Rosa. Goza. Rosa. I'm Goza. Or do you say Goza? Goza. Yeah. Goza. So, anyway. A Gosa. Uh, raspberry Gosa. That's a tart wheat ale with raspberry. You had me at tart. You had me at wheat. You had yeah. me at ale. And then mm. you got, uh, this is Claremont Craft Ales. Okay. Uh, let me see. Who's the brew by? It's brewed by, and you know what is nice that out here in the, in the sunlight, I can see. Uh, this is another oh, LA beer, uh, nestled in the what, labia? Uh, what did you uh, Cal say? California beer. Oh. Um, nestled in the base of the tallest mountain in Los Angeles County, Claremont Craft Ales Claremont? is committed. Yeah, Cla Claremont Craft Ales is committed to a unique mm -hmm. philosophy of continuous experimentation, mm -hmm. precision, mm -hmm. and premium craftsmanship. To show our community what beer can be. Okay. Now look at this. Can you see that? Nope. I so, see like a white smear. What I'm saying when I'm outside like this, I can read it. I don't uh, have my okay. old lady glasses. Um, and anyway, so it's just a smear on a pink. That's Claremont. Uh, I don't Claremont Craft Ales from Los Angeles County. Why put white writing on the pink? Candidate? I know. It's hard yeah. to see. But you know what? Okay, that's cool. This is our take of a traditional. Liz, lip, 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 lip zig style goza. What the heck is goza. a lip zig? A, l, 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 I, l e i p z i g. Lip zig. Lip zig. Goza. Lip zig. Change approved. We're screwing that up. <laughs> uh, it's it's slightly salty. Now. Ooh. Slightly salty. Oh. Slightly tart. Okay. Wheat beer. Add in some raspberries, okay, and, the, chart, and the result chart, is chart. incredibly refreshing and, and satisfying. There, okay. Okay, you this is exciting. All that you had all that. It, this is this is five point five percent alcohol. Okay. I don't think this is a pint. Oh, it is one no, pint. No, well, it's less than this. Look. Well, what? Oh, that's a skinnier can. This is a fatter. This is Maybe. a fatter can. Yeah. No, they're not. Oh. They're exactly the oh, what same. What the hell? This is taller. Uh, one pint, th three point two fluid mm -hmm. ounces. It's so that's bigger. a little bigger. Yeah. This one and a third. Right. This is one and a third. Y this is just one pint. Okay. One and a third. Huh? Nice. Okay, Claremont. I can, so, I can, I can smell okay, the raspberry. Okay, so that's the tallest mountain in LA. LA County. 
LA County, yeah. Claremont. Ooh, Ooh that's you pretty. You see how pink that is? Pretty, 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 You're such pretty, a pretty, 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 pretty girl. girl. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> what's, what's that from? Rolling Stones. Pretty, pretty, I don't like this. Pretty, 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 pretty. I know, I'm not, you know not a fan what? either, but that song. Whenever I hear a song, song from the Rolling Stones, I turn them off. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't like their sound mm. in them. And, and everybody smoking a weed right now going, hey. <laughs> Let's go listen to this. Let's go listen stone. to the Stones. That's funny. Stone. Hey, we had an okay. ACDC song on the other day, and Travis says, I do not like the sound of this guy's voice. <laughs> Babe, a lot of people don't, but you'll like it. Keep listening. <laughs> when you get older, you'll love back in black. Trust me. <laughs> he's like, he kept grabbing his head. He goes, okay, I do not like his voice. <laughs> Well, Duly it was, noted. Okay, let's, let's let's just say that it was it was <laughs> was it Brian it was, Johnson or Angus? Yeah, I don't remember who it was. Well, it was Brian Johnson, but it was okay. it was later <laughs> it's it, just when funny. when Brian Johnson's voice started like just sounding like gravel. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, okay. I got okay. worse over the okay. years, but anyways, that's uh, funny. Okay, Craft Ales in Claremont, California. Good. This is okay. Boom Can by Claremont Cat Craft Ales. Okay, this is okay. an ale. And I love it. I love it. And this is a Raspberry Gosa. Gosa? Gosa. 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 All right, let's smell it. Oh, it smells good. It does smell good. This is, and I love, is this a wheat? This is a this wheat. Is, this is a wheat craft. Oh. It's a wheat, um, it's a raspberry uh, tart a wheat mm. ale. Oh, wow. Okay, there we go. It is very tart. And refreshing, just like the bottle said. I mean, can. Wow. Mm. But you know what? They said uh, raspberry. I, I taste more cherry, but maybe I taste raspberry. raspberry. Totally. Maybe it's raspberry. Oh yeah, totally. I was thinking cherry. Um, oh, that's good. Look that's how pretty. Good. Do you see how pink, pink, pink. and orangey pink. compared to wait? Just to show our people. Yeah. You see the difference? Wow. Yeah. But here's so the thing. Pretty. This. I love ales in a way. I'm a big mm -hmm. fan of ales. I'm. I mean, look. I'm. I, I'm. I'm going to brew one here. Now that we uh, have the cooler up and going, I can keep the temperature down in the house the for a bit. Evap. Yeah, the evap. Um, so I can. I can actually next week. I think I'll mm -hmm. brew that ale. I, I got an ale going okay. that we can do. So there's anyway, an ale for that. There's an ale. For, there's an app for that. So, <laughs> there's an ale wow. for that. Wow. This, this is, is really I good. I like this over this better. I did well. I mean, I do. I would drink this. Um, this, this is sweeter. Is, this is almost like a sour. Um, I love sours. Right, it doesn't classify itself as a uh, sour. Uh -uh. It's just a, uh, a a tart wheat ale. Oh, I never rated this one. What, what was I going to rate this one? Oh, we forgot. All right, let's go back. Okay, um, uh, this is your IP for an IPA. I'd give this an eight because it had the okay. the, the sweet wait, notes. Wait, wait, wait. So wait, I liked it. Wait, stop. That's what I said. Uh, when what do, what do we call it? The we're, appraisal. We're going to we're do the appraisal. appraisal. Yeah, so we're going to appraise these beers. Yeah. Okay. For the value of what you get, I'd give it an eight. Um, You're gonna get what you get. It promises what I never it gives. Said, so. did I? I'd say an eight. I don't like IPAs per se, but this one I would. Uh, let me taste this guy. I, I mean, I really love because uh, I love ales. Maybe I'll um, give it a seven. No, it's an eight what? because APA yeah. is APA. I, IPA. IPA. No, this this one's a good IPA. It is for an IPA. Um, this is on the higher yeah, for me. Yeah, it's good because of the notes of mm. vanilla and mm. um, orange. Mm -hmm. All you ladies, you know what I'm talking about. You ladies. Sometimes the IPAs are just a little too bitter for your mm. delicate flower mouths. Yeah, but this one would work good because there's a sweet note and there's also the orange vanilla flavor, which makes it, oh, it's really good. Just know what you're getting yourself into if you ever order an IPA. You know. It's a, it's, 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 it's loaded with hops. It's so loaded see with that? hops. Yeah. So make sure there's some notes yeah. of vanilla and now. orange or raspberry or something to okay. balance that. I'm gonna go. Up, I'm gonna go up on this one. I'm gonna give okay. it a. Um, an IPA. Oh yeah, I like it a lot. I'm gonna I give, give it a nine. Eight. See, I give it an eight. I'm I'm it a nine. nine. We're both it's real good. Giving good, good yeah. scores. Good appraisal. Now this one. Um, the Claremont Craft Ale Raspberry Gosa. Gosa? Oh, Gosa. this is really good. It's it is good, ale. but I'm I'm not gonna give it a 100 percent because there's always I like them. They're it's different. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you got the you, you got the the ale craft here, and you got so what's the wrong with IPA. It? Nothing. Oh, you got the IPA craft. So they're the thing is they're both unique in their own way. Yeah, I'm not, I'm gonna, not comparing the two. I'm I'm judging this by itself in the classifications of ales. I'm not I'm not that an APA. IPA. Right. So so what I'm saying is, um, as an ale goes, mm -hmm. oh, it's very good. Yeah. Um, as a as a IPA goes, it's very good. It's very good. Right. So what do we do? I would. 
as my appraiser goes on this one, I said it's a nine, right? Yeah, you did. Um, let me taste this one again. No. Craft Ale Raspberry Gosa. Mm. I could drink the shit out of this over and over again. I'm going to give it a 10. That's great. I love this Craft Ale. It is very good. Mm. Um, I, it's a 10. It hit all of my marks. Okay. Well, you're you're going to have Oh, I didn't the, hit this mark. <laughs> ouch, ouch. Yeah, she beat, do you see what she did? You see what she did? She's beating me. Um, I'm a mean drunk. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I'm going to give it an equal score. Okay. Of uh, nine, as, okay. as I rated this Those one. Very good, very good scores. Uh, yeah, because it Eight is and good. Nine to me. It is good, yeah. but I also love this one because I like IPAs. So true, and I love this one more than that right. one. Right. That's why I give this one a ten. Okay. Oh, you ladies, you gonna <laughs> like it? <laughs> you ladies, because <laughs> well, it has the ladies. sweet note, and we who doesn't love wheat? Come on, you know. I'm yeah. Who yeah. <laughs> you high five uh, Them. Oh, okay. You. Yeah, you do it again. That person right. out there. All right. Hey, hey. Oh. All right, everybody. You hit hard. Guess what that was? That's fun. That was our drunken pool review. <laughs> it was fun. Hey, we but had to a... celebrate the first day being in the pool in Phoenix, and it's April. But it's, it, it's not a it's not a pool review. It's not a beer review. It's a beer perspective, perspective. on Claremont Craft Ale and Call of Troy. Call of Troy. Um, Imperial. No, the, it, well, okay, I want to say one more thing about this mm -hmm. because when, I think you picked this because you saw the can and you really liked it. Um, I did not realize it was an IPA. I think you I saw, picked it. Oh, I picked it. Okay. Yeah, because it was a tall. It was tall. And you're <laughs> like, tall. hey, let's try this. It's um, vanilla and I orange. I saw uh, orange vanilla. I yeah. didn't see the IPA. And, and I'm you so know glad I would I like orange vanilla because you know I like orange yeah, vanilla. But I'm so glad I did because I'm it so was a really too. good one. Yeah, and so. we're so glad that you're here watching this. If you reached it to the end, thank you. Yeah, okay. We need to do more of these. By the way, in the pool. I got to get out and uh, shut that off. Okay. Bye. I probably have to get out and pee. Okay. So, do it. I will do that. First, I'm going to drink.